Hi, in this video, I'll show you how to firmware update your Sony ZV-E1 from version 1.02 to version 1.03, one step at a time. All right, let's start. First, turn on your camera. These first few steps does not matter what order. Make sure you have enough battery. If not, charge it. Press the menu button. You want to format the memory card. Navigate down to the camera icon or shooting menu. Within that menu, select media group, then the format item. Within format, select enter to perform quick format. Now step off and navigate down to the setup icon. Within the Setup menu, go down to Setup Option Group. Within that group, select Version Item. You want to check the current software version. It should be lower than 1.03. Then select OK. You could now turn off the camera. Next. Open up a browser and go to sony.com slash electronics slash support. There, select cameras and camcorders. Digital cameras. Interchangeable lens cameras. E-mount body and ZVE series. In the tab selection, select Downloads. Scroll down and select ZVE1. Here, select System Software Firmware Update version 1.03. On this page, you could examine the instructions including the benefits and improvements if you want. And or you could follow along. I'll show you the rest. The objective here is to download bodydata.dat, which includes the version 1.03 firmware. You can also pause the video to see the instructions in detail. Next, let's select Download. Scroll through the user agreement and select download again. Here you can sign in for download, create an account for download, or download now without an account. I will sign in because I have an account already. Either way, the firmware will be downloaded. It would take a couple of minutes, but I'll fast forward here. Once downloaded, you could minimize the browser and go into your download folder. There, you should see bodydata.dat file. Next, remove the memory card that you formatted earlier from the camera. Then insert it into the reader on the computer. You should now see the card drive. Open it up and drag it to the side a bit. Now drag the DAT file to the root directory of the memory card drive or just right into it. Once transferred, eject the memory card drive properly. Remove the card from the computer and place it back into the camera, making sure the card label is facing you. Now you can turn the camera back on. Press menu and go back to the version page. 
on this page, the software update box will be available to select. Select software update box. Now scroll down until the execute box is highlighted. Then select execute. The screen will go blank. The red LED light on the bottom of the camera will start flashing. It would take a couple of minutes, so I will just fast forward it here again. Once completed, you'll see this message on the screen, body update complete. You could just select OK. You can now go back to the version page to see the new version number. There it is, version 1.03. And the software update box is now grayed out. The process is now complete. Thank you for watching. I hope you come back for the next video.